Hi everyone, Sully here from Black Ops Toys coming at you today with an unboxing of the new ENS release. This is the CBRN, Chemical, Biological, Radiological, and Nuclear Defense Assault Team. There are two different versions of this. There's an R and an S. This particular S version is limited, so I think only 200 units worldwide. But very, very nice figure. I've been looking forward to these for a very long time, and I'm very happy with this release. So this is the box. It's an art box, nothing special. And then let's take a look at the trays. So first tray, lots of goodies here, okay? A lot of really good stuff. You do get a really nice rifle. If you know what kind of rifle that is, leave that in the comments below. Again, all the moving parts, just like we've seen with all the ENS releases. Very good, very good tooling quality, but very nice rifle. This is camouflaged, so you do get various parts that are all camo. You get a tack light, nice PEQ, really nice red dot. Really nice suppressor. And you've seen a lot of these rifle parts with other releases. That's just how they do it. Um, and then they, they do different colors, but you can basically buy all these gun parts and use them on any ENS rifle or any damn toys rifle, etc. Plenty of magazines for stuffing the pouches. Little GPS kit. Now this has a lot of new parts, okay? Nice little G pistol. I love the uh, Zev down there, the little flared magwall. Again, all moving parts, just like every ENS. Do you get a really nice foregrip for the rifle? So plenty of stuff to dress up your, uh, your kit there. Do you get a couple of extra pistol magazines with butt plates? Love these pistols. And then you do get a really nice comm system. You can see it's got the arc rail adapters. Really nice quad eye NVG kit. And they've really, their tooling's gotten a lot better on these from their original stuff. So really nice quad eye with the battery pack. Really nice holster. Fits like a glove. Let's take out all of this headgear. So you got the radio, comm system, and then this little guy. And this is what everybody's wanting right now. If you know what that's called, leave that in the comments below. But this right here is for your little PDA. And it's just like the real thing. You can strap onto your vest or belt. But typically you carry it right on your front of your plate carrier. NVG mount. And I think that that's it for the uh, communications and headgear. So you do get a really nice set of these things. If you know what they are, leave that in the comments below. But they're for your rifle magazines. Do you get a really nice retention lanyard? Just like the real thing. Really nice belt. When we sell uh, the parts from this, we're gonna do a complete belt kit. IFAC, love these things. little strobe for the helmet. So much good stuff. A little light for the helmet. Then you do get some uh, grenades. And then you do get the uh, grenade holsters. And these are super, super cool. But these will fit on your belt or any mole, molly system. And they close just like that. So super easy way to dress up a figure, but I absolutely love these things. I use them on a lot of my figures that I build. Do you get some pouches for your vest kit? Do you get another magazine holster for the belt? Do you get a little wrist coach? And that would hold your map, your map or your directions or whatnot. And then I think a tourniquet. That's it for the tray. More rifle parts. Again, flip up sights. Picatinny rail attachments. Really nice set of patches. Super cool. Helmet padding and your little map for your wrist coach. So lots of stuff there. Let's go over to this side. Nice helmet. Again, camouflage. Got a little overspray there, which is super cool. You get a couple more hands. 
you get a couple more feet. So if you wanted to take your figure and utilize feet and put on a different set of boots, you can. Let's take a look at the figure. Now, there's something super cool about the figure, okay? Great head sculpt, but this particular suit is what I would consider a real gem. It's a one-piece suit. It's got built-in knee pads, different than the uh, first release. The first release didn't have the knee pads, but really nice chemical suit. Nice plate carrier and multicam. But I love this suit. And then these shoes right here are some of my favorites, okay? If you know what kind of shoes those are, leave that in the comments below. These are peg type, so you can use them with any peg body. But the level of detail in having cloth, super, super cool. I actually had a couple pairs of these shoes in, in real life. But great looking figure right there. And then you do get this thing. And this is what everybody's going hog wild about. And that's an entire, entire breathing apparatus. But backpack, you got the hose. And then you do get on this release a yellow colored lens. But super, super cool. And this is just cool to have, you know, in your, in your action figure arsenal. But really nice piece of kit. Um, again, two different versions. One has a yellow lens. The other one came with a clear lens. But super, super, super cool. Really happy with that. And then you do get a, another gloved hand. And then you do get a repelling harness. And that's about it. But fantastic release. Easy and simple. And very, very cool parts. A lot of great gear here. And highly, highly, highly recommend it. If you like this video and you want to see more of them, make sure that you follow, like, subscribe, and share. And uh, wanted to take a minute and thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.